Okay, well, my name is Michael Begay. I'm from the Navajo Nation. She here, she lived to Bahim, but she and Kiani the Shache, the Bethlehem and the Shanella. I am the eighth grade social studies teacher at Santa Fe Indian School. About three years ago, we decided, uh, Mr. Harold Poyer and I decided to go ahead and create a different type of experience for our, our children to experience other native religions and other. Um, historical relevance to um, to what our teaching philosophy have at Santa Fe Indian School. So we decided to go on what's called a highway history tour. So we go out and visit um, regular just um, common sites and we go in different directions. Uh, one year we go to South Dakota, Wyoming, Montana. Then this is our second phase where we, last time we did this, we went all the way down to the most southern part of Louisiana and visited some tribes down there and learned about their culture and their, their ways that they do things. This time we're actually coming through Muskogee, we're going to head up. So we started off in um, Texas, drove through Texas, went to Comanche Nation and we um, went to um, University of o Oklahoma and let them see um, uh, a university. Then we also went up to uh, an Eagle Refuge in Iowa tribe and then also then from there we're going to make it back through um, Oklahoma and then we want to finish it off with um, visiting uh, the Bosque Redondo in, in New Mexico and that's to commemorate the 150 year of the Navajo Long Walk. So a lot of the sites that we do look at, it does get our kids ready for when they do go to high school and they do see that um, when they start doing native studies that these are the places that they visited and kind of the places where those subjects that they're gonna read about that they kind of get a grasp on it, kind of like a hands-on experience. Yes, um, one of the things that we push here with, the, with our highway history tour is that we'd like to let other tribes know that um, there are other tribes out there. So a lot of tribes, even our students, don't realize that there are 540, 30 plus um, Native American tribes out there. So we try to bring a little of what they know and what they can share with other tribes and hopefully that there's an exchange of ideas and cultures. And also sometimes they can see that there are some similarities in a lot of the things that they do and that also helps them understand their traditional ways and their traditional values and see how well and how it's implored out in different parts of the country.